Me, just to do 95 McDonald's bingo. We each, Herc, Herc is here as well. He is not participating in the bingo, but in this game, we each have a McDonald's bingo board. It is on the screen right now. First person to get a row or a column wins. He has no chance at all. Excuse me? Oh, damn it. I forgot, I forgot that the window was open. Yeah, and I'm right next to you. Well, Jazz295, uh, link in the description. Good luck. You're watching a David Gerard video. Check out his merch link in the description down below. Okay, guys, so my strategy for this right now, we I have Herc on my side, so that's always a plus. We are at, I would, okay, I'm kind of nervous, not gonna lie. Not gonna, this guy's backing in, it is snowing. If you guys don't know, I have a Nissan Micra, the cheapest car in Canada, and in this challenge, we're gonna be driving around a lot. Not ideal. We started in a McDonald's parking lot, so I'm gonna go over here driving while pulling a dog in the snow while making a YouTube video. Not the best, not the best. We're losing traction, we're losing traction. All right, well, I've explained my thing now. He's slipping and sliding because uh, one thing we didn't plan for this video was snow. There's snow all around us right now. This is horrible. Literally in the middle of February right now. I don't know why it's snowing, but it is. So we're gonna have to deal with that today. Um, which is great because uh, we have to drive everywhere we're going. So this sucks. I know which one I'm gonna choose. I'm gonna choose this row right over here. I'm gonna get the three muffins. I'm gonna get three blueberry muffins. I gotta find the other person. So obviously I gotta find Derek because there's no other person here. Uh, but I'll leave it last. Hi there. Hi. Um, could I please get a sausage, egg, and cheese McGriddle, McGriddle meal with a, a coffee, please? Sure thing, what size coffee? Um, just a small black coffee. Small black coffee. And sorry, actually, can I get that with no, uh, no sausage, just an egg and cheese McGriddle? Sure, that's everything for today? That, that is gonna be everything. Meanwhile. I gotta go to five McDonald's, which honestly for me, Pretty easy. I am a McDonald's nut. I know where every single McDonald's is in this city. There's six of them available, and I only need five. So that's covered. Um, hash browns. Boring. Hi there. Hello. Oh, <laughs> Thank you so much. Bye. And last but not least, a filet -O fish meal. Okay, food has been secured. We need to park, eat. Jazz Paul is still in his car talking to, to the camera. I don't know what he's thinking. I literally already have my first one. All I gotta do is eat it. Loser! Loser! That's my one advantage right now. I have snow tires on my car. Loser! I... You're a loser! Oh, I'm a loser. I'm a loser. Who's loser doesn't have snow tires on the car right now, huh? He laughed at me. He's like, why are you spending that much money on snow tires? Well, look at this right there. Right? It's snowing. One of the things says find the other person. I don't know if I'm gonna be doing that, but Jazz Paul might. So I am going to park not right next to him. I'm gonna drive up and like around the parking lot. So he doesn't find me. First stop I'm gonna be going to is the first McDonald's and I'm gonna be getting hash browns for myself. Five hash browns. So let's go. Yeah, okay, like nobody's been coming here except for the snow plow unless Jasper buys a snow plow. Is there any parking here though? Well, when in doubt, you make a spout. A spot. Spout? Whatever. I've decided to take my hat off because I was getting kind of hot because I'm getting nervous because I cannot fit up this challenge. It is McDonald's after all, and I'm McDonald's king, so I'm already at the first McDonald's over here. Hi, can I get uh, five hash browns, please? Five hash browns? Yes. Anything uh, else for you today? And can I also get a blueberry muffin as well? That's everything. Great, five hash browns and a blueberry muffin is 1201. Thank you. Thank you. Hi. We're still waiting for the hash brown, but this is the blueberry muffin. Okay, no problem. <laughs> Just pull number one. One over there? Okay, thank you so much. Listen, I love McDonald's, all right? I, I genuinely do love McDonald's, but come on. Every single time, every single time, it's literally five hash browns and they don't have that ready. Like, come on! Also, I wanted to explain why I didn't get all three blueberry muffins right away because, you know, it's just a rule I've created for myself that if I want to five McDonald's, I want to, you know, have a little bit of. A, a challenge within a challenge. I want to see who makes the best blueberry muffins. So right now I'm at this McDonald's, first one here, and I'm gonna compare it to the other two McDonald's. So that way, just for future reference, I'll know which one to go to. I want a blueberry muffin. Parking has been complete. I have my sausage, egg, and cheese McGriddle. And for those of you guys wondering, is Derek quitting his vegetarianism again for videos? No, I am not. Um, to promote vegetarianism, in this video, every time I'm gonna be eating meat, I have prepared veggie patties. So if I have to get a cheeseburger, a Big Mac, I'm going to be asking for it with no meat and putting in my own veggie meat patties. The picture didn't have any sauce, so I'm gonna have this glorious hash brown right here as fast as I can. Mm. 
Mmm! Herc, you want a little bit of the hash brown? Okay. Oh, I don't know if that's cheating, but maybe, Herc, if I look this way, you can uh, take a little bite for yourself. There you go. Okay. Oh, oh Herc, what are you, what are you doing? Let's finish this. Oh. Let's start digging into our sausage, egg, and cheese McGriddle. I haven't had one of these in a long, long time. I'm mean, not gonna lie, this was not very smart of me. It is not the best way to start your morning, but when I was in the drive-thru, I was looking on here, and there's, I picked the first thing that I saw that was a breakfast item, because I didn't want to waste any time. Being that I'm gonna be able to knock off this breakfast one right here, I think I'm gonna go with that row from top to bottom, because I really don't want to have hot cakes right now, or just more bread, and, and then just a Big Mac with no meat, no lettuce, just the bun, no. And letting the person in front of you decide, no, I'm not doing that again. I did that trend, I beat it to a pulp. I am still, I'm still doing the f***ing trend. What am I even t We're gonna go with the top down, Happy Meal, a pickle, Big Mac, the breakfast meal, three iced coffees, that's nice. Find the other, okay, I'm gonna end up going with find the other person. And a no hands ice cream cone. We need to finish this and start. I don't think this is safe to give to a dog, considering I don't even know what the McGriddle, what is, what is, what is that even made out of? <laughs> it's like I don't even give a f what it's made out of, it's just so delicious that it doesn't even matter. I need to drink my black coffee now, but it's way too hot. McDonald's coffee is really hot, well, not when I was working there, when I was working there I really didn't care. <laughs> you know, two minutes old, twenty minutes old, two hours old, it doesn't, it's all the same, right? No? Is the reason I got fired? Yeah, I know. It's perfect that I live in Canada right now because I can just open up this coffee and I can take some of the delicious snow off the ground. We're gonna drop that in there. Boom, bada, bing. That's gonna be room temperature any second. Let's add a little bit more. Add some more snow in there. Try and cool this thing down. I have seen a video of a guy boiling snow and it was like all like gray and black and full of dirt. So hopefully that's uh, Look, that's only American snow. Cheers, guys. It's time to chug this. Alright, we're done. We can cross that off the list. So that is our breakfast meal crossed out. That is completed. So now what is next? So it is currently 10.36, another 25 minutes until I can get my like Big Mac or my Happy Meal or my ice cream even. So I'm gonna go for the three iced coffees next. Now I love coffee, some may say I have an addiction, but those people wouldn't uh, know what they're talking, what they're talking about. Um. I don't know if I'm gonna be able to complete three iced coffees in one sitting, so it might be one of those things where I have to buy the three iced coffees, and as I'm trying to knock out other things, I drink them. Let's go grab our iced coffees now. I wonder how Jazz Paul is doing. Oh, okay, future Jazz Paul and Derek coming in hot. Um, I forgot to ask you guys to like this video if you want a part two where we go to somewhere else, Burger King, Subway. Let us know in the comment section down below what place we should play bingo with. Be sure to subscribe and turn on your post notifications if you have not done so already. All right, going back to the other guys. All right, hash browns and blueberry muffins are secured. Let's go, let's try to finish this off right now. I'm gonna leave this one to the side, actually. I'm gonna label it number one, just to see which one is the best food brain muffin, one, all right. Oh my God, the amount of grease that's gonna be going in my body. I'm so excited for this, this is horrible, but you know what, it's okay. Look at this, you guys. Look at that, oh yes. First hash brown, let's go. I can't get the filet fish meal or the Big Mac until 11 o'clock. So that gives me, what, 30 minutes, I have to wait 30 more minutes. So I got one McDonald's down, I got the five hash browns, which I eat right now. That's easy! I've never actually tried hash browns with ketchup before, so, you know what, let's just, let's just see what Derek actually is talking about. Oh my gosh. This tastes really, really good! What?! Derek was right?! I'm not gonna tell him that, so, um... It's so good, I can't stop it. Ketchup with hash browns is actually pretty decent, I'm not gonna lie. So I'm never gonna tell Derek that. So this stays between you and I, okay? This stays between you and- you, The fans, this stays between you and I, alright? He will never know. On the second hash brown now. Ah! And another drink. Let's do this ketchup packet. Ah. Holy smokes. I'm gonna finish these last couple of hash browns off. And I'm on to my next McDonald's. All right, time to mark off the five hash browns. Boom, one down. Four more or five more to go. 
God damn, I'm so bad at math today. I'm sorry. <laughs> All right, I just made it. Too bad this is uh the snow is kind of blocking out. I'll let me get out and roll it. Just stop it, all right? Derek FaceTime me, you guys, to try to showboat, but you know what? He's not gonna get away with anything. I'm gonna hang up right now. There you I go. Was just trying to ask you. There, I hung up. You didn't hang up. What, what? Why wouldn't I hang up? Oh, there. Because I had your phone. Bye! <laughs> Shut up! Number two McDonald's over here. I'm not gonna lie, me and this McDonald's have bad history. I don't like it that much. Every single time I go here, they ask me to wait. So this is gonna be. Interesting, let's just see if they ask me to wait again. Hi there, can I get a blueberry muffin, please? A blueberry muffin? Yeah. Do you want your coffee with the combo? Uh, no thank you, just a blueberry muffin. So it's 1046. Okay, thank you so much. Hi, can I please just get three medium iced coffees with no sugar? And can I get light cream as well? For all of them as well? Yes, please. Thank you so much. Well, would you look at that? They didn't ask me to wait. First time for everything. Well, that's blueberry number two. I'll mark it down in the bag. Thank you so much. Thank you. Bye. Second McDonald's is in the books. I'm driving while recording. This is horrible. I'm a bad idea. Do not drive this at home, please. I'm a trained idiot. Three iced coffees have been secured. Uh, it's still another like 20 minutes until they start serving lunch. So I think what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna drive around, drink all my iced coffees, and try to find Jazz Paul. So on to the third McDonald's now. I have two down, three more to go. Let's go! We got this! I'm driving by the spot where we originally started and he is not there, so I imagine he went to a different McDonald's, but that's all I can really do right now. So I'll see you guys once lunch is available. Okay, so now we have reached McDonald's number three. That's three down, two, four, two, four to go, two, five, five minus three is, uh, okay. uh, yeah, two more to go. Let's go, let's get the blueberry muffin from this bad boy right over here. Going to McDonald's. Hi, can I please get a Big Mac with no meat? Big Mac, no meat, okay. And then can I get like, just a massive side of pickles? Like, I'll pay for it. Okay. Like, can I get like, like 30 pickles on the side? Oh, 30 pickles? Yeah. All right, anything else besides that? That is everything. Oh boy, thank you. Thank you so much. Yes. Hi, welcome to McDonald's. What can I get for you today? Hi, can I get a uh, blueberry muffin, please? I'm so sorry, unfortunately, we actually ran out of blueberry. Uh, oh. It's in the oven, but it is like Uh, okay, then that's fine. And uh, I, I just wanted a blueberry muffin. That's okay then. Okay, sorry. All right, no worries. Okay, okay, bye. Are you kidding me right now? Are you kidding me right now? Really? How do they not have that? I just don't understand. Uh, the next McDonald's. So I already hated the one before I went to this one. The next McDonald's is quite possibly the worst McDonald's in all of British Columbia. It's, it's just that bad. Derek used to work at this McDonald's. When I was working there, I really didn't care. You know, two minutes old, 20 minutes old, two hours old. It doesn't, it's all the same, right? No? They have a bad habit of messing up people's orders, um, having stale food. One time I had a Big Mac from there. Like the bun was, it was so hard. It was like, it was frozen or something. You know, you don't mess with a man's Big Mac, right? You just don't mess with a man's Big Mac. And these guys did. So now I have to rely on them to get me my last blueberry muffin. This is just gonna be great. This is just freaking fantastic. One iced coffee is down. I still have two left. I am just making a pit stop at my apartment with Herky because he had to pee. And I also had to pee. We met up today at nine o'clock, it is now 11, and all I've had in my body is two coffees, and I'm acting like this is different than every other day, but this is every, this is every day for me. So I was not able to find Jazz Paul while I was waiting for the lunch menu to start, so what I ended up doing was I looked at my list and I saw the thing on top of my breakfast meal, which was the pickle mac, the big pickle, the big, the disgusting, who? ordered this and why was I able to find that on Google? And now I will forever be known as the pickle guy after having to go through the McDonald's drive-thru and ask them, hey, can I get a Big Mac with no meat? And instead of the meat, could you substitute just so many pickles that any normal human would probably want to vomit? Oh my God. I think in a video from a while ago, I said, if you get extra pickles at McDonald's, you're just straight up weird. I don't know where that anger came from. I actually love me a nice pickle, like just a whole one out of a jar or one on a burger, a sandwich, whatever it may be. This, it won't even focus. It, it literally wants to stay focused on my face because even this disgustingness is cuter than this disgustingness. Here we go, we're checking off the bingo. I would stall as long as I could, but I want to win this challenge. We gotta eat this burger. 
Okay, so what I can say about this burger is that um, I think there's just a little bit too much pickle. If you <laughs> if you find that, yeah, I know, it's shocking, right? Wow, that's like hard to eat. Are you ever eating and you're looking at the burger trying to find the perfect bite that has like everything in it? Yeah, this one, the all the bites are just, they're just all terrible. But I have to finish this burger. I want to be Jazz Paul in this McDonald's challenge. Herc, what? What do you want to share? Would you like some? <laughs> Herc wouldn't eat it, but I have to. <sighs> we got it! We can now, we can cross off the pickle Big Mac. We are working on our iced coffees and now all we have to do is the Happy Meal Ice cream with no hands and find the other person. We're gonna win this! And here it is, folks. Quite possibly the worst McDonald's in the, probably the country, I'd say. This place sucks. Hi, can I get a uh, blueberry muffin, please? One blueberry muffin? Yes. Anything else? Uh, that's everything. Next meal, please, thank you. Thank you. Wow, the most unreliable McDonald's in the world happens to be the most reliable McDonald's in the world. Thank you. Wow, was not expecting that, to be honest with you. Um, so now that I have all three, I'm gonna taste test all three McDonald's over there. So we have all three blueberry muffins over here. First place we went to, let's just say a little taste test right now. Let's see if there's a difference. Now you might say, oh, they're warmed up. No, all the blueberry muffins are not warmed up. There's a hole in my bag. There's a hole in my bag for the first place. That's, oh my God. First bite, this is the first place. Let's see how that blueberry open. Not bad, I like it. It's pretty good. All right, let's put this aside for now. Let's taste test the second one here. Is there a difference? Ooh, this one feels a bit more softer. As you can see the difference, this one's a bit more uh, harder, I'd say. And this is, it's even more dark. I bet like they cooked this one a bit too much. Let's take a bite out of this one here. This is number two. Let's go. Oh, this is good. Now this one, number two, I'd say two is better than one, which is weird because that was McDonald's and I have a, like, that, that was the second most hated McDonald's. <laughs> All right, on to last but not least. Oh my God, what? This is first, second, third. Why is that like, they're getting lighter and lighter by every McDonald's I went to? Let's take the third one over here, third bite, here we go. No. Not it. We have a winner. The second most hated McDonald's happens to have the best blueberry muffin. I don't know why that is, but that is. <laughs> I'm gonna finish all three muffins off right now. And I can also mark off the three muffins. So we have the five ash browns, the three muffins. We've been to the fourth McDonald's. We have one McDonald's left. It's 11, it's 11 o'clock now, I can, have, I can eat lunch. So next McDonald's, I will be getting all these items to eat. That's gonna be great. Actually, I could just go right here right now. I should, shouldn't I? I'll just go to this McDonald's right now. This is gonna take a while. So I'm gonna finish eating this up and then I'm gonna go order <laughs> the Big Mac with egg in it. That's gonna be, all right, let's just see what they say to that. Hi, how can I help you? Hi, so I have a, an interesting order here. Um, So can I get a Big Mac, but can I take out the meat and replace it with um the egg you guys usually use for like your uh, sausage and egg McMuffins? Okay, so can I order that a, a Big Mac with no meat, but then can I like get a uh, an egg on the side like the yeah Can I get two? Can I get uh, two of them, please? Okay, anything else for you? That's everything. Nine dollar next window, please. Okay, thank you Okay, right, thank you Big Mac, two of them. That egg smell is absolutely horrible. All right, let's park up and do this again <laughs> Okay, so now I got <laughs> Two egg little things on the side, which is ugh, like that. Then I got a Big Mac with no meat. I am absolutely disgusted with myself. That is, oh man. Oh, look at that, look at that. Okay, so I gotta put the egg in between the buns. So let's make this happen. Move the top bun here. <laughs> and then uh, I'll move the middle part here. I mean, on top of the cheese. And that on top of here. <laughs> this is so gross. This is honestly so gross. I feel like I'm like doing something illegal right now. This is so big! What is this? All right, here we go. <laughs> Bottoms up. 
honestly, surprisingly not bad. But that, I think that's because of the Big Mac sauce. But, oh, <gasps> the aftertaste. The aftertaste, what's good to you? Bro, that's, oh my god, that's nasty. That is nasty. Oh my god, I'm gonna take one bite. Mm -hmm. I'm sorry. Oh man. Oh, I really tasted the egg there. Oh, you know, I haven't drank anything all day either. I have not had one thing with a drink in it either, so this sucks. This is like a vegetarian eating meat. You just don't do that. Oh my god, this is a weird taste to it. My chest hurts, this hurts so much. Ugh. All right, I'm gonna finish this off. And then make my way over to the very last McDonald's. You're gonna pay for the dick. You're gonna pay for the what I just did today. You're gonna pay! Alrighty, last item here. Come on now. Uh, can I get a filet fish meal, please? Um, that's everything. Thank you. Hi. Hi there. Coke? Yeah. I like your coat. Is that McDonald's? Sorry? The, the logo in your Oh, coat? yeah, it's the Cactus Jack, uh, it's Travis Scott one. That's so cute. Thank you. Thank you. Awesome, thank you so much. All right, so we have made it to the very last McDonald's, McDonald's number five. This is my favorite McDonald's because we have filmed so many videos here. They always get my order right. I never have to wait. It's just perfect. I love it. Even the employees were super, super nice. I mean, like, I got my filet fish meal right over here. The employee loved my Cactus Jack merch. So, legendary filet fish meal with the Coca-Cola on the side. I've been dying for this. Um, I have not drank anything all day. I need this right now before anything else. Dude, I'm so thirsty right now, you guys. You have no idea. Oh, yes. I needed that. I needed that. Let's go to snag a flat front. I don't know, I can't even talk right now. I'm so hungry. Look at that. Isn't that just perfect? That bun is just so beautiful. Oh my god. They made this thing. You can't go wrong. I love this McDonald's. My favorite McDonald's, alright? First bite, here we go. Mm. I didn't even plan for this to be the last McDonald's, but I'm so glad I did because I am so happy right now. I'm so content. They made this perfectly. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. The amount of grease that I have consumed today is enough for an entire year. This definitely takes out that egg Big Mac I had before. The map, that that flavor is gone right now, and I'm just I have the flavor of love in my stomach. Because it's gonna hard to talk and eat at the same time, but let me finish this off, and then uh, I'll talk to you about what's going, what we're gonna be doing next. What up, sucker? <laughs> sucker? Yeah. Dude, I just already won. I finished. I got bingo. No, you didn't. Because I just finished. I just finished my bingo. You know, last one is I found you. So technically, I won. <laughs> You're the same one as me? You're I, in the same, I have, to, I have to find you. I have to get the blueberry muffin, the five McDonald's, the five hash browns, the egg Big Mac, the filet fish meal. I've done every single one except find you. And technically I did find you and I called you, so. No, no, find me in person. Oh, shh. What do you mean? I won. I won, think about this. I called you, which means I found you. You answered. You find me in the body IRL in real life. It's either you have to see me in real life or I have to see you in real life. You're not gonna find me, loser! <laughs> I have completed all five and only have one remaining, which is find the other person. So that means I have to find him in real life, which shouldn't be too difficult because he's predictable. I'm coming for you, Derek, and I'm tagging you down. Okay, guys, um, I am panicking right now. I'm filming this on my iPhone. I picked up the ice just Ah! 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 Okay. This is so dumb. Jazz will FaceTime me. He said he is done. I don't know if he's telling the truth or if he's lying or if I should really be driving while doing this. I have to eat this ice cream cone with no hands. So I have to go home. I have the Happy Meal purchased. It's it's over there. I'm gonna go home, eat the food. When, I'll explain when I get back. I'm panicking, okay?
All right, back at my apartment. I have all the food I need. I don't know where Herc is. I'm gonna get all need all the help I can get, Herc. What are you doing in the? Come on, Herc. I need your help. Come on. So Jasper says he's finished. I don't know if that's true or what even is true anymore. But all I know is I have to finish my ice cream. I'm gonna finish one right now. All right. All I need after that is the Happy Meal and the ice cream with no hands, and then I need to find Jasper. I don't think he's gonna come here. When he FaceTimed me, I was here, so I don't think he would think that I would wait in my apartment when I think he's- This is a- there's a lot of thinking and acting and assuming. Hopefully Jasper likes to pull the double, triple, sometimes quadruple bluff, and I still don't understand them, so we're not even gonna try to worry about that. What we're worrying about right now is this ice cream cone melting and I have to eat it with no hands. Three, two, one, let's go. Perfect. That's perfect. I probably should have cleaned my counters up before this. I don't know if not wiping my face is part of the rules. I just want to need to get this ice cream cone down. It's so cold! It's melting all over the counter! How am I prepared to- <sighs> yeah, I don't know how to get my- get around a little piece of paper. Flip it. Okay. Oh, it's so cold! I'm getting a throat freeze! That's right, baby. I caught you. I found you. You you just got caught. I win, baby. I win. Ooh, that's disgusting. But I win. That's right. No. I win the challenge. Where were you? Yes. For once, I have done it myself. The one, the only. Jazz Bostonil has won a no. challenge. Where's your bingo card? On the Derek Gerard channel. Where's your bingo card? Where's your bingo card? Huh? Where's your bingo card? I got right here. Let me go back to my closet. Let's switch to this camera because- Why are you in the closet? <laughs> Shut up! You know you actually had to do- Six a row. You actually had to do the Boom. things, you know that, right? You, you, Sorry? You, you, you actually had to do all the things. You didn't just X them out. I did every single one. <sighs> Painfully. You ain't need me at an egg Big Mac, dude. Who eats an egg Big Mac? You! A are we gonna camera off right now? I'm gonna my camera down here. That's right. Why did you let me eat this? Why did I was in the apartment for like 15 minutes? Why didn't you just come out when I came oh, in? I'm sorry, you had to enjoy a ice cream cone. An ice cream cone. I had to have an egg Big Mac. Oh my god. The person looked at me like, really, dude? Really? I thought with that kind of hair, you'd be used to that. Um, I, I don't know about you, but dude, look at your hair. <laughs> I'm having an emotional day. Okay, well that's the video. I'm gonna make sure that Joe, when he's editing this, makes sure that Jazz Paul actually finished the challenge and not he's just saying that he did when in reality he just walked around all day doing absolutely nothing. Herc has to take a poo. Not true at all. I finished the challenge completely, properly, correctly. I won fair and square. I did not do anything bad. I snuck into this place. It's the only bad thing, but is that really a bad thing? Herc, he was in the apartment by himself. Who leaves a child by themselves like that? So what'd you do? What I do? Yeah. Oh, well, easy. I just uh, took a copy of the key years ago, um, and then I, anytime I need to go in here just to escape every now and then, I come in here without you knowing, and then I use that <laughs> to my advantage this time. And That's gonna do it for this video. Jazz Paul wins. Thank you guys so much for watching. Be sure to check out his channel, link in the description. If you guys want a part two, you know what to do. Comment down below telling us where we should go and what should be on the bingo board. Always remember the motto of do good, die great. I'm gonna win part two, guys. <laughs> um, you know Jazz Paul's trying to cheat and do terrible things to me? Oh, you can play that game. Don't touch me. Do good, die great. Bye! And be sure if you have not yet do. <laughs>